Happening today, voters in communities across the metro will cast their ballots for important local elections. So polls are going to open in just a couple of hours. Liza Lucas is uh, joining us with some more. All right, Liza, tell us what do we need to know as we are so close to people uh, getting ready to go vote in these closely watched races. That's right. You know, we started seeing the cars rolling in this morning. It's pretty dark behind me here in Jonesboro, but I counted about 50 candidate signs just showing you the buildup that we have for some key races here in Clayton County. One of those that we're going to be watching closely is going to be the race for a new sheriff. Now, this special election called after former Sheriff Victor Hill was arrested and convicted on charges of abusing inmates in his care. We have a picture this morning for you. You can see all five candidates on the ballot here for Sheriff. Voters, meanwhile, in Clayton County's District 75 will also be casting their ballot on a Georgia House seat. Now, turning now to Cobb County and a live look this morning in Mableton. This is another election to watch as residents vote to elect their first mayor and council. The election comes after residents voted last year to create a new city. Today marks their first chance to elect their first city government. Early voting turnout has been low, we should mention, so far in this race. So this is another one we're going to be watching closely, especially in terms of turnout. Now, circling back here to Jonesboro, again, residents here, they're going to be also electing a new mayor as well as two council seats. As you mentioned, the polls open at 7 a.m., so a little less than an hour from now, and we'll be standing by bringing you the latest throughout the day. All right, Liza, and the same rules for absentee ballots apply for these special elections? Yeah, so if you are opting to vote absentee for this special election, same rules apply as the general back in November. You want to bring your ballot down to your county elections office. You must get it in by 7 p.m. tonight. Sending right. it back to you. All right, polls open in 55 minutes, Liza. Thank you. You can find complete coverage of today's special election and in-depth looks at each race on the ballot on 11alive.com.